Hey peeps, Skazanos here, back with my playthrough of Shenmue 3. We've finally beaten the village thug, and we are gonna interrogate him. Some Shenmar, Shenmar did something to him last time. Well then, to terrify him. Talk. And we don't know what. Whatever she did, now he's willing to tell us whatever we want. I said talk. Who are you? Who are you? My name's Jin Lang. I'm just a common thug. Well, well, maybe not common, but <laughs> you get my drift. I still can't believe I caved into this girl. You were easy. I've had a harder time breaking chopsticks. <laughs> you win. Do what you want with me. Have at it. What the hell has she done to him? You turned around quick. What's up with this girl anyway? She's absolutely brutal. Speaking of, mm -hmm. what exactly did you do to this guy, Shenhua? Oh, you want to know? I can give a demonstration. No, <laughs> no more! Please! Pretty please, even! Shenhua. What her? Why did you come to Bai Lu? We better find out. You want to go for round two? No, no, ma'am! <laughs> then talk. At first, we were ordered to search for a mirror made out of some kind of special stone. I forgot what it was called. Phantom Rift. But we couldn't find the damn thing, no matter where we looked. Is that why you targeted the stonemasons? I've been... I don't hear an answer. Ring the bell, yo. Okay, okay, I'll talk! What? Go on. When we reported back about the mirror, our next order was to kidnap its stonemason. I knew it. So you took my father? You kidnapped Mr. Yuan? Yuan. Yuan. Yeah, sounds familiar. He, he was the only one that could carve that whatchamacallit rock. Phantom Riverstone. Where did you take my father? Where is he now? We handed him off to the other guys. Where did they take him? I don't know, I swear. The thing is, our gang has several hideouts in a town along the Lijiang River, but I don't know where they all are. Oh no. This can't be happening. You better not have laid a finger on him. No, no, he's fine, I swear. They said to hand him over in one piece. No injuries, no scratches. Father. Well, that's good at least. So who's your boss? Who ordered you? Was it that creepy looking guy with the hunchback? No, not him. Our orders came from higher up. So who are the higher ups? I don't know. What? What do you mean you don't know? No, really. Hmm. I honestly don't know. Is it you, man? You think I'm going to fall for that? Ding, ding. <laughs> so you do want some more? No, I'm telling you the truth. I swear on my life. When we talk to them, we weren't even allowed to see their faces. What's this thing with the ring and the bell? What has she done to him? What? And if we didn't comply, they would have killed us on the spot. That skinhead guy's just a watchdog. He was there to keep an eye on us. Is he cheer you men? I was gonna say, he's gotta be. Hard to say. It's not like we could just ask him. We just kept our mouths shut and followed orders. <laughs> you know, search for the mirror and its stonemason. What did you tell him? Not much. I just gave him intel on the bridge. Wait, the Verdant Bridge? Why would you... What's so special about the Verdant Bridge? What do you know about it? Tell us! Beats me! Never hmm. cared in the first place! In fact, what do I care now? There's no turning back for me anyway! <laughs> Come to think of it, nothing matters anymore! <laughs> you piece of... Take it easy. If you want to know that bad, go talk to the old hag. Oh, old hag? You mean Elder Ye? Uh, sounds about right. If you care about her, then you better get going. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? You know that Chai guy? Oh, no. He should be at that old lady's place right about now. If I were you, I'd leave now. I'm telling you, Chai is one sick puppy. He'll go to any lengths to get what he wants. Even to a sweet little old lady. <laughs> Damn it! Leo, we have to go to Elder Ye's house right now. We got all we need to know. 
We have to hurry to Elder Yez. Yeah, you're right. Let's go. Mr. Wong, Mr. Liu, we're done with him. You can let him go now. Oh, God. What? What? You're not seriously thinking about letting him go, are you? The longer he stays in the village, the more trouble he will cause. And there's no guarantee that his friends won't come for him. Oh, yeah. That's true. Anyway, let's hurry. Oh, let's hope he leaves and stays out. I I I jam. Something before I fall oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I forgot that I got absolutely butchered by those guys. Now, we'll keep the buttons. You never know when we might need to pay another visit to Sun. Do, do, do. It's only like 10 seconds away. She's in the main village square, isn't she? I assume her house. I don't think I've ever even been to her house or seen it. But there is, I think there is a house next to where she kind of bangs her thing. Well, she's making medicine, isn't she? I think. So I think she's like crushing stuff. There is a house next to her. Oh, there she is. She's fine. For now. Got here in time, it seems. Yeah. If it isn't Shen Hua. Oh, and the young man from Japan. Come to ask about the Verdant Bridge again? <coughs> we have. And as I've told you, it's ancient history. It has nothing to do with you. Or does it? Hmm. Yeah, we're very much Phoenix involved in this. Phoenix mirror. How did you get this? My father left it for me. It's what brought me to this village. Hmm. Tell us about the Verdant Bridge, please. Su and Soon both told us you would know more. Ah, so you've spoken to them. Yes. It was over 70 years ago now. 1910, the second year of the Shren Tong Emperor, and I was but a girl. An Imperial Envoy was sent from the capital to the village. The whole village came together and built a new bridge so as to welcome him. And that's the Verdant Bridge. You know this bit. It was a hot summer <clears> afternoon. <throat> Su Suwan and I were trying to get a glimpse of the envoy and his troop. We could hardly contain ourselves as we waited near the bridge. At last, they appeared. They were resplendent. I can still picture them clear as day. The envoy came to command the greatest stonemason to make a set of mirrors of phantom river stone. And who was that? Well, phantom river stone can only be found here in Bailu. And of the stonemasons here, the Yuren name became known to the capital. They were the family that was chosen to make the special mirrors for the Emperor. The envoy gave the design for the mirrors to Yuren's grandfather. That must have been the mirror design we found at the house. Oh god, yeah. Which matches the pattern in the photo that we found at Man Yuan Temple. And the relief we found at the quarry. This pattern is everywhere. 
Listen carefully. Find the six tokens here, then climb the bell tower. The bell tower? That's what that tower is. Find the six tokens. What tokens? Like there are to six on tokens that. that serve as keys. You have to find them all. Where's Chai? I thought Chai was going to be coming after this. Maybe, she, maybe we'll do another time. What are they in here? Is it another one of these? Uh, <laughs> another one of these search missions? Oh, okay. I can move. Oh God, is it some kind of like, like puzzle where I have to move things around to create space to be able to reach stuff? Uh, must be. She's got to give me something more to go on than just keys. I mean, because I assume she doesn't mean a literal key. I she means she means some kind of uh, dried herbs and nothing else. Dried herbs. Boo, boo, boo. Looks like we got some more cupboards to open. Do you know, I don't know. I don't remember the beads. I know everyone made fun of Shemu One and Shemu Two, or a lot of people did. Ooh. Is that a nope. tape? I should look somewhere else. Oh. Should have brought my uh, tape recorder from Shenmue One. Um, you know, everyone made fun of Shenmue One and Two, but you know, oh, it's a cupboard open, cupboard open, and it's a token with a dragon on it. Oh. There's a piece of paper with it. Yeah, this might be a clue. It's like one token down. Let's take them. Token or a key? Mysterious scrap of paper. Okay, maybe the scrap of paper tells me what, which kind of. Oops. Nope. Maybe it shows me what. Stop it. Which things I'm looking for, or maybe? Mysterious, a mysterious scrap of paper found at Elder Yen's house. Ah, okay. So it's just... I don't know, I was going to say it's referencing the six keys, but there's more than six shapes there. Um, hmm, I don't know. It's, it, I assume we'll, we'll, we'll need that information or something. Yeah, everyone, you know, everyone used to make fun about Shimmy 1 and 2. Oh, it's like, you know, cupboard open simulator, cupboard opener simulator and all that. Um, but there wasn't actually that. I mean, obviously you could do it. It was there as like, you know, hey, you can look through his drawers if you want, but you didn't have to. Um, oh, hello. It's a crane design. Whereas this one has got a lot more mandatory drawer opening. <clears throat> There's a token here. What? What is it a picture it's two of? down. It's a crane design. That's it. <laughs> Good find. You didn't mention the dragon one to her. I mean, if this is her house, surely she should know where they are. Although, I think she is blind. So, <laughs> that doesn't help. Do, 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 do. At least so far, these ones have been easier to find than um, than some of the other searching. Bo, bo, bo. I feel like I just got unlucky with the when I was looking for the I was looking for the you know the really expensive wine. My oh, God, that took a while. <laughs> I suppose that that was like across multiple different shops across the whole town, so it was kind of that was a pain. This is useless. I need to. I'm just wondering if it's going to be like inside or a pot or behind a pot. Or... Okay. It doesn't look like it's going to want to let me move stuff like that. Alright, I'm going to look in all these drawers and see if we can find any more. I don't want forks. Yeah, that's what, that was my point. Like, I don't know. 
if it's just my memory or you didn't do it so much in the first one, um, or the first two, um, I don't remember it taking so long to open drawers. <laughs> open and close them and stuff. I don't know, maybe it did. Hey, here we go. That looks it's like... sword design. That looks like the mystical sword that we uh, saw at the very end of Shenmue 2. <clears throat> Elder, yeah. Hmm. Halfway there. Something there. A token with a sword design. Yes, that's it. Boom. Do you know what? I bet yeah, I'm gonna get like five. Or either I'm gonna get five or I'm gonna kind of um, Like I'll I'll have my hand on the sixth one and just as I get the sixth one, Chai will turn up and like snatch it off me, you watch. It's gonna happen. I've called it now. There's no way they mentioned that Chai might be coming here, and he's just not going to bother turning up. Maybe like, I don't know, maybe as I'm climbing the bell tower with all the six, he's going to jump on me or something. Ooh, hello. I see number four. It looks like a fist design. A fist design. So we've got Crane. Dragon, I think, was... I think dragon. I found a token here. I think it's dragon, crane... What? What's the matter? Fist sword. It's a token with a fist on it. Looks like you found it. Okay, this is going... <laughs> this is going smoother than I expected. I thought it was going to be a horrible... Horrible task to find six. Although... I don't want to speak too soon, because, you know, I might find five dead easy and then, you know, the sixth one is just impossible to find. Boo. Boo, 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 boo. I kind of think, I, I probably shouldn't have gone this far, to be honest. I kind of think they're going to be all in these cupboards. What's that? Nothing out of the ordinary. Well, it's a set of keys. Be inside these cupboards. Well, let's open them. Let's have a look see. Boom. I mean, we can half see through them, and I don't think there's one behind there, but. Don't want to take any chances. Don't want to just assume it's not there, and then I kind of. Because I assume it's not there, I never look, and it's. There we go. Boom. Number five. What's that? This design looks like a moon. Father's heaven, nine dragons, mother's earth. I don't know where that came from. A token. Did you find something? It's five down. A token with a moon design. That's it. So what's the, uh, what's the design of the sixth one, old lady? She must know. Why has she been keeping these all this time? Do, 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 do. Hmm. Got no more. Guess it could be in here. Do, 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 do. Just the old old ladies' wellies. Oh, hello. This was dead easy. So much nicer than the this other set of tasks. Design. An alcohol design? Fair enough. Elder, yeah. What is it? A token. There's a picture of alcohol drawn on it. That's what we need. <laughs> That's what I need. Get the alcohol. Right, boom. We got all six. Let's go to the bell tower. We've got all six tokens. Elder, yeah. I found them all. Oh, you did. You should take that up the bell tower. For some reason, I thought that getting all six was going to be this, like, mammoth mission that was going to take, like, a few episodes to do, not, like, five or ten minutes. Right. Let's go up the bell tower. I have actually been to this Look lab. At the time. Oh. I'll try again tomorrow. Fine. 
I've actually been to this little, this ladder before, and um, never actually, it wouldn't let me go up it last time. Guess you gotta wait for the right moment. Right, okay, we're gonna get some sleep and come back in the morning, do the bell tower. Right, here we go, look at that beautiful sky. Look at this, this village is gorgeous, it really is. It's so different to, um, that it's... Consider finishing activities in Bailu Village before proceeding. Oh, like that, is it? Um, I'm just trying to think if there's anything. I think I've got all the capsule toys that I want. Oh, I haven't, why have I not got that one? Whatever. Um, yeah, I wanted to complete all the sets. I can't find the shoe thing, so I'm guessing that's not here. Um, oh, I'll come back. I, if it, I'm going to replay the game, aren't I? So... If I'm going to platinum it, I'll do it another time. Let's go. I guess this means we'll even buy Lou Village then. Nice that they gave you a little hint like, hey, you know, careful. You, if you, if you're gonna, if you don't want to miss stuff, do it now. Yeah, but they, uh, this is such a different setting to what we're used to in Shimu 1 too. I mean, obviously, like, Shimu 1 was a very kind of cozy, small town, but it wasn't a village. It was, you know, it was city-like. Um, and Shimu 2 was, like, big city. Hmm. Yeah, this is very, like... I'm kind of hoping that the, the next place we go is more city-like. Where does this key go? Leo, hmm. take a look. Hmm? There's something on the pillar. Ah. Is that where the fist one goes? What the heck is this? <laughs> does this image mean something? What other images have we got? We've got a bird. Is that maybe where the crane goes? Oh, okay. Um, not alcohol. I'm thinking crane. Let's see what the other options are before we decide. Dragon. What's that? I can't remember what that is. That's the moon. That's the sword. That must be the fist. Oh yeah, yeah, it's the fist. Okay, I'm gonna go crane. That. They're both birdie. That's my theory. <laughs> a what? That's like a tortoise. What the? Oh man. Um, can I have a look at the other ones and maybe make some sense? Let's think about this a bit more. Yeah, I think we might need to. I think I, I, I think I went a bit too simple. Can I not? Stop it. No, I don't. I don't. Let me get out of this. The token might just fit in here. Well, it might do, but I don't know which one to put in. All right, fine. Sword. Drunk. Drunken tortoise. Whatever. <laughs> Two for now. Let's just let's slot them in and see what the options are. See what other stuff is. It's a constellation looks like. So we'll get to stick the moon in. Constellation, stars, space, moon. Hmm. Uh, fist, dragon, sword. I don't know. <laughs> Buns. Now that looks like that goes with wine all day long. Fist. Well, that's gonna be the fist, isn't it? So I need to go, I definitely need to go get the wine one back. I think the, I, I think the crane might be right. If we put the, the wine with the buns. It would just fire a process of elimination. I think a few of them are obvious and then the other ones might just slot into place. So the fist is, I'm sure the fist is right. I'm pretty sure the crane is right. I'm very sure the alcohol is right. 
Does dragon go? Is that a dragon? I don't know. It, maybe that's not even a tortoise. I don't know. It looks like a tortoise, but with flaps coming off it. I don't know. Nothing's happening. Damn. Let me rethink this. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So that's not right. Uh, the, sorry, the that's. on the pillar and the token. Could they be part of one drawing? Oh god, it's completely restarted me. Oh man. Okay. Right. I want to look at that mysterious. Let's think about this a bit more. Because initially I thought that that mysterious piece of paper might be a clue as to where they go. But it looked like there was more than six on it. Uh, yeah. It, that doesn't seem to. Doesn't seem to point to anything. Maybe if there's something on the back of them? No. Dragon. I, I still think a lot of them are semi obvious. Con I mean. I would think constellation. Moon? You think, wouldn't you? Right, I'm gonna have another bash. Okay, so I th I'm Constellation Moon, semi confident on. Not confident on you. That's definitely. This has got to be alcohol. Slash wine. Wine and buns. I mean, are they all. Maybe they're a, a reference to. Maybe there's like six different, like, grandmasters. Maybe there's like six martial arts masters in the village, and this is a reference to them all. Um, maybe that isn't a crate. Maybe that's a dragon. No, it's definitely no. It's more birdie. I'm a, I'm I'm happy with the crane. I think. Um, maybe give the sword to the thing. <laughs> And then the dragon to the only one that's left, which is like, I don't know, is that like a sun or...? Did that do it? I don't think that worked. No. Something must be off. Right, let me have a look around. Maybe there's like some... Nope, I don't know. Nope. Maybe the there's images a, um... on the tokens and the ones on the pillars are paired. Yes. A turtle? I'm aware of that. Oh, it is a turtle. Okay. Um, so I was right. Let's think about this a bit more. Um, maybe there's something, maybe there's some, like, markings on the bell. Hmm. No. Okay, well, I'm I'm gonna definitely put the ones in that I'm like I'm gonna put the, okay I'm I'm gonna put the ones in that I'm a, like almost a hundred percent confident on, which is the hand and the alcohol. Are, I I would say are definite. None of the others. Like, I, I'm I'm not entirely sure on that. I mean, sword and shield, I guess. Maybe, maybe just ignore the fact that there's a constellation there, and it's this, it's just a sword and a shield, which kind of makes sense. Um, come back to you. This is definitely alcohol, and I'm pretty sure the bird crane thing. I mean, they all they almost look identical, the two images. Um, so if I give the crane. To that because the moon almost looked oh it's a moon and sun moon and sun is that what it is in which case you're the dragon oh, dragon tortoise dragon turtle what's that got to do it anything <laughs> i don't get that one but it's kind of it's the only one that's left sun and moon come on this has got to be it Nothing happened. 
Damn it. I believe the token is probably in the wrong spot. Thanks for that, Shenwa. Okay. Let me try this again. Okay. Right, okay. Well, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with every every almost everything that I did last time. So, I think there's only two that I can flip around. Sword and shield. I'm happy with. Sun and moon. I'm happy with. Um, what else have we got? Wine and buns. That's, that's, you know, that was the obvious, the most obvious one instantly. That's definite. Fist and the, you know, fist and like a palm. That is, again, glaringly obvious. Um, so I've got the crane. So I'm just going to have to swap these around. I did, because that's the, all I've got to go with. The, these are the only two that I'm kind of not 100% on. What a crane has got to do with a turtle and a dragon's got to do with a bird, I don't know. But. Boom, now we're talking. The secret. The secret seller. You watch. Now Chai is going to turn up and be like, Thanks for unlocking it for me. What's up here? Now this Ooh. is something else. It is. Doesn't look like anyone's been here for a while. It's very different to the rest of the bell tower. A hexagonal prism? This is a wheel repository. What's it for? You can find these in old temples. The monks keep sutras inside of them. Turning it once gets you through one sutra. But why is it here of all places? What's a sutra? Then, let's take a look. Won't budge. Something blocking it. So we've got all the things: the wine, the sun, the moon, the wine, and the buns. A fist and open palm. The crane and the dragon. Or the, and then, the, but then there's like a crane and a tortoise. What hell? Huh? to do them in a certain order or something? This... this is... This is what? Is this similar to the design on the mirror? Look at that. That looks like a slot for a sword. Shenhua, isn't this... Not the sword that his... Just like the sword of the head, seven stars. The head dad left for us. He specifically left it for us. What? <laughs> I've been carrying it around all this time. I suppose you keep it close when you, and it's not too big. I mean, it's more—it's more of a large dagger than a or a small sword. Big. I sense big stuff coming up here. Yeah, story wise. Um, how are we supposed to know which way to. I guess it will let us know. Nothing happens, even if I turn it. Am I missing something? Maybe we turned it the wrong way. Am I turning it wrong? The paper. The what? The uh. paper from Elder Ye's house. This old thing? <laughs> is it so? Is it saying turn it right? 
and then right, and then right. Left. Left. And there just so happens to be a splodge. <laughs> I'm gonna go left. And hope for the best. It's 50-50. Oh. Looks like we got... It looks like I got lucky. Right, right, right. I think that's it. Boom. Actually won a flip. What's this? What's this? We should head to Elder Yez's house. Yeah. This is blatantly gonna be weird. <laughs> if Chai hadn't got it the first time, he's definitely gonna have it now. Or he's gonna come up and snatch this scroll. Watch. Shenhua, dear, what do you see on this scroll? Hmm, well, there's a dragon and a phoenix. I'm certain of it. <laughs> there's also some treasure. So, if the dragon is the emperor, and the phoenix the empress, the treasure is the hidden treasure in their palace. Oh. We saw all of these patterns in the quarry. This pattern here is identical to the Phoenix Mirror. The Chiryo Man is desperate to find this mirror. For together, the Phoenix and Dragon Mirrors are the key to hidden treasure. This is huge. Anything else? The cormorant fissure and the hole in the rock. Well now, let me think. The poor town of Niawu along the Lijiang River has a cave rock you can pass through. Really? Yes, it's quite large. As for the cormorant fishermen... Yes, that hmm. is a picture of Niawu. I'm almost certain. The last picture extends out into a mountain cliff. Mm -hmm. A mountain cliff. It seems that the treasure at the heart of this calamity is hidden in those mountains. This is... a lot to take in. What could these pictures possibly mean? My dear, I believe you hold a map to the treasure. Yeah? Because... In the same way that the Chiyumen can't find it without the Phoenix Mirror, surely we can't find it without the Dragon Mirror. <clears throat> I don't know. I guess we've got a little bit more than them. We've got we have got a kind of a map of sorts. Here we go. Here he is. No. What are you doing? Damn it! You're gonna have to be faster than that, Rio. You again. Give that back! <laughs> I will not! For you are weak, but I am strong! The treasure scroll is mine now! What are you talking about? Why don't you come down here and fight me? But we can't I. fight. <laughs> I am strong! Then fight, instead of fleeing like a coward. Hmm. Okay, I'll fight! 
Oh! I didn't know it was gonna be a QT! I wasn't ready! Okay. Oh my god. Jeez, the fast in this, man. Left. Up. Oh my god! <laughs> Just failing at everyone until I see what it is. Left. Up. And it's triangle. These feel like brutally fast. Don't mess around with Rio. Give me the map. Are you with the Chiyo men? I know nothing. Say what? Where have you taken the stonemasons? They took them on a boat. You're in too? I don't know names. Two stonemasons. Long-haired man and an old man. Father, I'm sure. Where? Niao. <laughs> Niao. <laughs> Get back here! Did you get the treasure? We're headed to Niawo. The same place on the scroll. That beautiful rain. Did we get that? It wasn't really clear there if we got the scroll back or not. Like, Chai was running off and he didn't have it in his hands. But we didn't have it in our hands either. Unless it like it was on the floor. Oh. But yeah. I think this is a big moment, because I think we're leaving Bailu Village. Ah, this music. It's been nice. It's been nice seeing Shenhua's hometown and from a distant land in the east, from across the sea, he shall appear. He does not know of the strength hidden within him. The strength that would destroy him. The strength that would fulfill his wishes. When he is ready, he shall seek me out. And we shall brave together the rocky path. I shall wait. This encounter has been my destiny since ancient times. This is almost like, you know, if we were playing this on the Dreamcast, this would be like, this would probably be the end of disc one. A dragon shall emerge from the earth and dark clouds shall obscure the heavens. A phoenix shall descend from above. Its wings will create a purple wind. In the midst of the pitch black night, a morning star shall glisten, alone. Shenhua, dear, the time has come. Go with the one who holds the phoenix. This music. Farewell, Bailo Village. Bailo Village. Bailo Village. Done. The Phoenix Mirror. His, le his late father left behind. This young man embarks on a journey from Japan to Hong Kong and overcomes many trials to finally meet a girl named Chen Hua from Bailo Village. Right, here we are. A new, uh. Ni Wow, is it? A new. A new name for me to try and mispronunciate. <laughs> or mispronounce. Looks a little, definitely looks a little bit more city ish hmm. than Bailu. Definitely looks bigger. But as the, as the old lady said, it is a port town. Oh, look at that. 
That looks like a... We've seen that logo somewhere before, that little... Near the caves, there's like a, a yin yang inside a kind of octagon. I'm sure we've seen that logo somewhere. I suppose it's quite a common logo. Scary for Shenhua. She strikes me as the kind of person who's kind of never, you know, she's very much a little lo local village girl. She's probably never left her village, never been to like a big city or anything. I guess much like, much like the Shenmue One to Shenmue Two, where Rio was a small little village guy who'd never left home, never gone anywhere, and then bam, he was thrown into China, and overwhelmed by it all. Now I guess Shenhua's exactly there, the same. That's the famous bay. He can control any cormorant he puts his hands on. Your room number is 201. What? The hotel is on the harbour. There's a sign for Hotel Niawu. You can't miss it. Niawu. I'll have your bags sent up. In the meantime, why don't you check out the vendors in town? That's very helpful. Mm. Yeah. Have a great trip. No. Oh. I wouldn't... <laughs> I'll be honest. Wouldn't he be leaving me bag with anyone? Certainly not with the... Fe I hope he hasn't put the Phoenix mirror in it. Got bad experiences of... Uh, Shenmue 2 showing up in a new place and our bag going missing. Right, this is it. We are in Niao. A brand new place just off the boat, but we're going to leave it there for today. I can't wait to explore this brand new huge town compared to Bailu Village. But yeah, leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.